What is up YouTube? Today we're going to be going over another way you guys can glitch out Cover 2. Now if you are new to the channel and you want to know how to glitch out Cover 2 and Madden NFL 21, be sure you hit that subscribe button and we already have some money plays set up for Madden 21 as well. So hit that subscribe button for some money plays to kick you off in the new season. The play is post shot. Now this is going to look really similar to the gun bunch out of the West Coast offense. Uh, the formation is different, and this one alone is going to be able to glitch out the cover two. Now, stay tuned for the rest of this video, and we'll be showing you guys how you can bomb a cover three and how you can bomb a cover four behind this. So, to start out, we're going to be in a Tampa two. Now, with this setup, you need to make sure that Sam Watkins or whoever your fastest receiver may be in this case, Sam Watkins, I know only 91 speed, needs to be out on the field. I will say this, if you're playing Mutt, you're only going to be able to bomb a cover two over the top. You're not going to be able to easily be a cover three or a cover four because of the speed. So this is really going to be focused heavily on your eggs because at this point in the year, pretty hard to get away with bombs. Now, what we want to do is we want to take Bell, motion him over, put him on a flat route and A on a drag or whoever your Travis Kelsey may be in this situation. I'm going to go ahead and double team this guy. I think it's the left side linebacker. Yep, left outside linebacker. It's coming in our left screen linebacker. And we'll roll out to the right. Now, whoops. Without doing that, we're going to look for X over the top for one play touchdown by glitching out the deep half. Now, in the beta, I already figured out the way to glitch it out again. So, a reminder, you might want to subscribe for when the Madden 21 does drop. So pretty easy to set up, requires very little adjustments behind it. Now cover three is going to be a little more tricky. This in the case of regs is really where you want to have Tyreek kill in because what the inside third does or all Thomas is he will match for some odd reason. He will match that deep post route and follow him. So you're really going to need to have a high amount of speed. Now to beat a cover three over the top, you're gonna run this play stock. Let's just go ahead, double team this guy so we can roll out. Snap the ball. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Roll out. And you guys kind of get the idea behind it. Speed's gonna be king in this case. And he's right there while I'm talking about the inside third will match because of zoned out. So make sure you have a fast 99 speed receiver. But nonetheless, 91 speed in regs, still gonna be able to get the job done. So that is cover three. I'm gonna go ahead and just make some super simple quick adjustments to be able to get all of these guys into essentially what would be a cover four drop show two. So it's gonna be a bang, oops, bang, bang. It's something like that. And then you go ahead and keep it contained. This is what a cover four drop show two looks like just with quick adjustments. The same thing applies here. I'm gonna go ahead and hop off this guy. You're gonna just leave this place stock and you're gonna look for Sammy Watkins. Hopefully Tyrant Kill is who you have out there over the top for a one play touchdown. So wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Roll out to the right and bang, dot. Really easy to get any kind of zone coverage completely busted. Now you may be wondering, okay, well, if deep halfing doesn't work, and well, I'll show you guys right now. We'll go ahead and re-deep half that as I've been told that's supposed to stop it. I'll show you guys right now, it doesn't. So motion them over, drag, flat. This is again a three deep half. You double deep half, and essentially we even do it twice. So A is now being put back into the deep half again. He's been in a deep half this whole time. We'll snap this ball, double team this guy, and you're going to still see the glitch is going to work. So that's not how you take care of this. And out to third isn't going to play it over the top. A shade over the top isn't going to play it. A play the sticks isn't going to play it. Well, in fact, we'll do all that right now. We're going to go and shade over top and play the sticks. And that's kind of counterintuitive. But just to kind of drive the point home. So drag A, B on a flat. And wait for him to set his feet. Don't motion snap him. Otherwise, he will not run his route. So this is play the sticks and shade it over the top. Bang. Bada bing, bada boom. A dot. Tire kill obviously is going to be a little bit better in this case. So, two ways we can stop this play. The first one, this one's going to be really tough in regs. Especially if you go against tire kill is doing something like cross man. Now, what we would realistically want to do is put Humphrey 
over where Jefferson is instead because Jefferson I don't think has enough speed but we're just gonna imagine he is Humphreys over there because I don't want to take time to make an adjustment we'll go ahead and cross man him to Sammy Watkins you guys may be thinking well what if they send a guy on a streak what I like to do if they do perhaps send a guy on a streak is go ahead and put B onto an outside third and then you can take this vertical hook and put him into a hard flat and do something like this. So you really don't have to worry about it all too much. You can go ahead if you really want to play it safe and do something like this. And then user this guy. If you think you have a huge speed mismatch between your own DB and their wide receiver, the best thing to do is user it. You've got to be aware of when they're about to do this little deep half glitch. So motion over, flat, drag, making sure we're on the wide side of the field. Snap the ball. Right here, Sammy Watkins should get back for the most part. You can see it's a pretty big speed difference between two, and we're still able to get over top. That's kind of where Mutt is going to be a huge benefit behind it because you have 99 speed, you have 99 man, 99 zone everywhere. So it's just going to be really, really helpful. So the next best thing is user it. So let's go ahead and set it up again. Well, oops, I'm on the wrong controller. <laughs> Motion this guy over, flat, drag, and we're ready to rock. So in this case, a user in Madden 20 and Madden's past is for some odd reason faster. I don't know how than it is for stock speed. So we're kind of anticipating this little deep post shot to go off. We'll go ahead, uh, user as best as we can. <laughs> it's, hard, it's hard to do too things at once but hopefully you guys kind of get the idea behind it you're either going to need to cross man with somebody that has equal or greater speed or take it away manually and essentially just give up the check down in this case in a tampa 2 or any kind of cover 2 i'm going to go ahead and just look for using the mid read and then i'll shade down reflat these guys into cloud flats or soft squads, whatever. It doesn't really matter what you do. We can go put them cloud pods. You can tell I'm a little rusty behind this game. I'll hop onto the mid read right here, shade down, and then reflat these guys into clouds or to soft squats, whatever you may be. If you put them into soft squats, soft squats will not match up vertically because there's an immediate threat in the flat. So go ahead and play the flat like a hard flat and allow that deep shot to get over the top. So best thing is best case scenario, worst case scenario, however you want to look at it, is just use this mid read, take away the deep post. So that's going to take care of this video. Again, it's really hard to stop unless you guys play Mutt Regs. Uh, unless you send seven at them, there's practically no way you're going to be able to stop this play from getting over the top of any kind of zone coverage you may send out there. With the exception of cover three match, palms, and quarters, every other stock zone coverage that doesn't have match behind it is going to get bombed. Not only bombed, but smoked over the top. So, reminder... If you guys want more glitch plays from Madden 21, money plays, blitzes, etc., be sure you hit that subscribe button with those notifications on. And until next time, guys, get in the lab. This has been Team Maestro. See ya.